Una manera de distraerse en Miami es aprovechar los eventos sociales y culturales que se desarrollan en esta vibrante ciudad. Para los amantes del arte, todos los años se presenta la Semana del Art Basel, donde se pueden observar reconocidos galeristas, coleccionistas, curadores, críticos, promotores de arte y artistas de todas partes del mundo, quienes exponen y venden sus obras en diferentes escenarios. Con más de 70.000 visitantes, ofrecen una alternativa inspiradora y excitante de la más famosa Feria Internacional del Arte Contemporáneo del Momento. We're here at Red Dot under Concept Arts, which is the gallery I'm going through, and Red Dot's hosting a lot of us, a lot of artists, a lot of good art. It's my first basil, so I'm reflecting on fear and humanity, human emotions and how they evolve as things happen to us. And by that I mean, you know, world stage kind of events and how that affects our humanity internally. And for me it's pretty personal because it, it does affect myself as well, so I notice how I change with certain events and I want people to take a look at themselves in that manner and really question how well they know themselves you know under pressures such as fear of the unknown. My name is Nuria Carrasco Dominguez. I'm an artist. I'm also the owner of the gallery Concept Arts. Here you can see a painting that I did. This is four pairs of jeans sewn into the canvas um, with gold. I wanted to reinterpret the Baroque in the 21st century. This artist is Royal. He's a very famous artist from Spain. He's shown all over the world. There have been more than 30 books published about him and many, many museum shows. He's in the tradition of the Impressionists. He's a Spanish Impressionist from Valencia, Spain. And he works in what's called broken color, where he drags the brush through the colors and lets our eye mix the color in our experience of it. the past 20 years been doing uh, New York urban landscapes. For the past three years, because I was born in Aleppo, Syria, uh, the war and the destruction of Aleppo, my uh, birthplace, affected me and I wanted to make something positive. So I started uh, painting uh, Aleppo urban landscapes, buildings. I wanted to project hope, so I, I started very, uh, with my style, the single line style that I created for the New York urban landscape. Thick paint, short lines, with bright sunshine and uh, bright sky, uh, which suggests hope. My name is Michael Halley. I'm a Cuban-American artist, uh, local in Miami. This piece was made out of 3,230 Cuban domino pieces. We play with the double nines. Um, I chose Jose Martí as the subject to my, to my piece, it's basically because he's a, he's a Cuban icon, a revolutionary, free thinker, artist, poet, um, so making the, making the piece with the Cuban dominoes is a perfect fit. Hi, I'm Weldon Ryan, and uh, I do a Carnival series. My, my work is about the uh, Carnival diaspora, the Carnival of uh, parade and so on. So I, I go around from Carnival to Carnival taking photos and from there what I do is uh, I, I take the best shots and of course I paint them. I want that interactive in your face because you know Carnival is about that energy and uh, if I can grow that out then I'm happy with that. Hi I'm Kevin Grass, I'm at Spectrum Miami and I do figure paintings on panel. They are done with acrylic using traditional techniques no projecting, no tracing, it's all freehand. And the subjects are typically about America. 